these companies, especially like Gibson or Fender, it's like, yeah, we're, we want to ramp up. It's like, what the fuck? How, how many more guitars can you sell? And yeah. how many guitars are out there just like not being played or, or I don't know. It's so I really appreciate like builders, small builders who just say, yeah, I build like 20 guitars a year or 10 guitars a year. Right. And I, I devote myself to quality over quantity. Cause at the, at this point there's a, there's so many luthiers and builders of all kinds of things. It's like, how many, how much of this stuff can, can we consume? You know what I mean? Right. right. If you did the math, it probably comes out to everybody in the world owns five guitars. Totally. I mean, but people keep, I mean, there's, there's money in it still. I mean, there's always those times that pop up when we say the electric guitar is dead. It's right. you know, pretty soon. And there's that thing that we talked about and talk about sometimes that as soon as the old, you know, the boomers die, no one's going to care about vintage guitars, which I don't believe at all. Yeah. But you know, there's crazy kids crazy young kids that are into this stuff 